talking to fishtails. I'm gonna put the big popper on. Like I said, I'm going for big bass today. It's just, this water has cooled quite a bit since the last time I was here. That was just last Sunday. I mean, four days ago, this water has cooled a lot. It feels great. Let's see what's in here. Come on, big bass. I got my big, giant, orange-bellied popper. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be a day. <laughs> that was a, I don't think that was a very big bass. Come on, fish. Oh, he chased it. Oh, there he got it. <laughs> happiness, happiness. Right on the end of that line. Look at that bass. That's a nice one. That's a nice fish. That fish chased it several times. Hit it three hit it three times and finally got him on the third one. Ah. Oh Lord. <laughs> Jamos got a sunfish on that a bass ate. <laughs> no, I don't think so. I think I caught the bass. Yeah. I, I don't see no sunfish. <laughs> Oh yeah. Not the big ones we're seeing, but one of the ones they're trying to eat. Yeah. There's one. There's a fishy fishy. That'll be a sunfish. Big one. Oh yeah, there's a good fish. Oh yeah. Not a giant, but a good one. Alright, let's throw the big giant popper at him. There's a bunch of fish in here, and I think some of them are big, big, big bass. This old cloud cover should ought to bring them up, man. This cloud cover ought to bring these fish up near the surface, no problem. Come on, big bat. Oh, <laughs> oh it's good to be right. <laughs> That's what I thought, man. They're throwing them little old bruminators. They want something more substantial. <laughs> oh, oh, that's so good. All oh, these fish are fat. Oh. Orange belly popper strikes gold. I caught this fish on. He's not even a great big one, but he's a good fish. checked in and get on down there I'll bet Jay Moore's already here okay my fun. Steve thanks throw that popper right up underneath them trees Jay Moore got here at 630 fish for an hour caught one crappie and nothing else when JMO don't catch fish, they're not fish to be caught for whatever reason. So, we're gonna go hit the road and go to Trading House. Trading House Reservoir. Be there in a minute. Well, Trading House was, it wasn't a bust, but these clear blue skies, relatively steady uh, barometer, and we saw fish jumping everywhere, but we struggled to catch even a half, well, I don't know how many JMO caught. I caught two, a catfish and a sunfish. The bass were up in the weed beds and they just couldn't get at them. I, I, needed, a, I needed a weedless fly of some sort, but it, it appears as though they're feeding on shad mostly. 
uh, and that's pretty difficult to catch a bass on a shad lure when there are millions of shad. The place is just thick with them. I mean, you, it was almost constant where somewhere within earshot there'd be a, a, a bass hitting something on the surface back in the weeds, out in the open, just any place. But I was probably lucky to catch a catfish like I did and then one, one red ear sunfish. So I decided since I was only 15 minutes from the office in Waco, I stopped by there and took care of a few things with our office move. Got some users up and running and had lunch. And now I'm headed to the outpost on the Brazos River, 2114, FM 2114, where it crosses the river. I have a lot more confidence in the Brazos River to catch fish than I do almost anywhere else. And this particular stretch is easy access and should be fun. I mean, I'm going to wade it. I've got my boat, but I'm going to wade fish it. Uh, to start with, if I need to get in the boat, I can. If I feel like going upstream, if I have time. But I'll, I'll fish till about 6 o'clock, get home about 8. 8, 8.30. It's all good. It's all good. There we go. Dick's Canoe Rentals in at the outpost. It used to be called the outpost. I don't know if it's still an outpost. But there's my parking spot. And if anybody else is coming in here, this is my parking spot. Don't take it if I'm here. If I'm parked here, it's mine. River looks good. Let's get to it. There we go back for another quick adventure about three maybe four hours of fishing oh, look at that river yeah baby this is it buddy this is it It's just slimed up bad. Needs a good flush. All right, that's good enough. If I leave now, I'll get home about dark, dark 30. So let's do it. 